Hi, my name is Shio Washido from Lynn Next Nick and welcome to Shop Talk. We're in our presetter showroom in front of our flagship model, the E68 LA. Let's talk about how this machine will benefit you and your shop. In day-to-day -day operation, when you're working on a workpiece, do you run into inaccuracies forcing you to redo the cut? Or how about machine tool setup taking too long? If these are some of the issues you face, the Elbow Controlly Presetter will help you. In this episode, we'll be talking about the inefficiencies of downtime, the five key feature points of a presetter, and how it differs from traditional machine setup. Now, let's talk about machine downtime. Machine downtime refers to the time the machine is not operating. It's time that the machine is not producing, which means less money. Incorporating the presetter in your shop will help you reduce that time due to its ability to work offline and the connectivity it has to the CNC machine. Before moving forward, let's talk to our resident engineer about the other methods of machine tool setup. Okay, we are in the inspection room with Eric. Eric, thanks for coming. Sure. You have these tools in front of us that are used to set up tools. Can you explain more in detail how they're actually used? Sure. So here on our inspection granite, we've got four tools that can be used to set up a height offset for a tool in your CNC machine. We probably have the oldest method right here. A feeler gauge could also use a piece of paper. Sliding it on your part as you bring your tool down. Um, high chance you might break a, a drill tip or chip an end mill with that. It takes a lot of time too. Then you have a little LED unit with a spring-loaded top here um, that'll tell you when you get to a specified height. And then this is a little bit of an upgrade from that. It's a dial indicator, so you can actually tell if you're a little bit over or a little bit under. Here you just get the LED. And then this is probably the best one of the four options. It's going to be a dial indicator unit with an LED and a magnetic base to make sure it's in place. Um, but these all share one thing in common, is that they take a lot of time away from your machine spindle, where you could be cutting chips, but you're wasting your time setting tools on your CNC machine. Okay. Uh, the presetter is able to work offline, so of let's course. go to the presetter right now to talk about the five key feature points of it. Let's go take a look. Okay, we are back in front of our flagship model. Eric, can you tell us the five key feature points of a presetter? Sure. So here on the E68LA, just like on all of Elbow Controlling Nikon's presetters, we have a base and a column that are made out of natural granite, just like the inspection table we were on before, or like a CMM. Now it's always going to be more thermally stable and flatter than any cast iron or cast aluminum that the competitors make their presetters out of. All right, the second thing I want to talk about is all of our presetters feature an interchangeable spindle. So just by lifting up, you can swap out from a 50 taper to a 40, an HSK, Capto, whatever you need. Um, you know, some of our competitors use a adapter system with a Cat 50, so you always get a stacking of error that's possible there, whereas here you're always going straight to your machine taper. Next thing I'd like to tell you about is the connectivity of these machines. Whether we're using Ethernet, Wi-Fi, USB, we can do QR code scanning, we can do Balif chips, however you need to send data, we can do it. The other thing too is we have 50 of the most common post-processor formats that are included with every presetter. And these are easily customizable to meet whatever your needs are. Along with the post-processor and the connectivity features, all of the presetters have an easy to learn icon based software that's upgradable for the life of the presetter. All right. Eric, is there anything else you can say about the presetter? Right. So, based on your needs, maybe this E68LA might be a little bit big or advanced for what you need to do. Maybe you just need to quick touch off one tool. Um, our product line has everything from small tabletop models to medium size floor models to, like I showed you before, the giant E68LA. All right. Eric, thank you so much for coming on to the show today. Of course. All right. To recap what we've seen in this video, incorporating the presetter into your shop will save you time and money in the long run due to its efficiency and accuracy. That's it for me on the presetter. I'm Shio Washido. Thank you guys for watching Shop Talk. If you want to see more content like this in the future, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.